Hi, this is Sharon uh, from scstatisticalprogramming.com. So in this tutorial, let's uh, continuously talk about create output using ODS system. So in this tutorial, I would like to talk about how to use ODS to create Excel output. So we're going to use uh, ODS Excel destination statement to do that. So using Excel destination statement, we can create multiple Excel sheets according to by group variables values. So first, I'm going to use PROC import procedure to bring in an Excel data file, a score data miss, and then the output SAS data file, I call it score data zero. All right, so let's run this. So this data set, score data zero, it's been created. So it has several variables and also total has uh, 12 rows and total variable or columns. In this data set, we have five columns or five variables. All right, and then before we move to ODS statements, I want to sort the data, score data zero. I want to sort it uh, by gender because later when we run PROC means in PROC means procedure, I'm going to use by statement, by gender. So in order to use this, we need to sort the data by this same variable, gender. All right. So the input data is score data zero and then output the sorted data. I call it score data one. All right. So let's sort the data. So uh, this score data one, it's been sorted by gender. So we can see it's in descending order of the values of this gender variable. First is the, um, the missing value and then F, then followed by M letter, okay? All right, so let's look at the ODS statements. So first, ODS Excel, this is the keyword. That means we want to uh, use ODS to create output Excel files, all right? And the following the file equal option, uh, again, I'm including the complete path and also the complete output file name in this option. So this is the Excel file I want to create. I call it multi underscore table and then follow with uh, Excel extension because I'm going to create an uh, Excel file with multiple sheets uh, included. And here there are uh, some options I listed here to customize the output Excel file. So this first one is this sheet underscore interval. So this option uh, specifies that a new sheet is created after each by group. So in this case, our by group is gender. So that means this option will create multiple new sheets for each value of this by gender group. Okay. And then the second option is this one sheet underscore label. So this option specify the text gender equal. This is the text as the first part of the worksheet label or name. Okay. So that means for each worksheet, it has its own label and uh, name. So for those names or labels, it, it will start with gender equal this text. All right. And thirdly is this embedded titles option. So this option specifies that the title created by the title statement is embedded in the Excel worksheet. All right. And then lastly, embedded titles once this option specifies that the title is embedded once at the top of each worksheet. All right. And also there's a, another option I want to mention here is this ODS no proc title statement. So this will surprise the writing of the procedure title that produces the results. 
So in this case, if I don't include this option, then the means procedure, which is the、uh, procedure title, will be showing on the worksheet. But that one,、um, we don't really need、uh, that title. Okay. So this is the ODS statement and options we want to include in this program, and in between. The ODS Excel statement and also the ODS Close statement is the、um, SAS program we want to insert. So here、uh, I use proc means to calculate some statistics, including the number、um, of non-missing、uh, values and also the means and the maximum and the minimum. I want to calculate those、uh, statistics on the variable. Here, so the variable I include is score one, score two, and score three. Those are the three score variables, and also I want the statistic to be calculated for a、uh, different by group. So that means I want statistic calculate for gender equals F or gen gender equals M separately, and also I include. A where statement here. I only want to include the observation that has gender not equals to missing value. That means this calculation, this procedure, I only want it to apply to the gender equals non missing value observations. All right. So let's run this whole ODS block and see what we got. Right, so this is the default HTML output provided by SAS. So you can see there are、uh, two tables, and the title is summary of scores by gender, which is the title I given in ODS block. And、uh, there are two tables. One table is gender equals F, and another table is gender equals M. Okay, and also the、uh, statistic were calculated. For、uh, different gender group, for all three variables, score one, two, three. Okay, and we also notice this table doesn't have procedure titles because we include that ODS option, no proc title option here. All right. So in order to look at the Excel file created from this ODS block, again we need to look. The files and folder directory. So the file name is multi-table. It's an Excel file. So let's go down to M. Yeah, here. This is the、uh, Excel table created from this ODS block. So right-click and then we can download the file. So this is the Excel file. Well, I want to enable editing. Okay, so we can see there are two worksheets included in this Excel file. One is gender equals F, and another is gender equals M. Okay, and、uh, we can see the title are included in both、uh, worksheets. And for gender equals F worksheets, so it has a statistic created from proc means procedure, and also those statistic were calculated for all the observations with gender equals F. Okay, and for gender equals M, it's the、uh, statistic table created for gender equals M observation. All right, so. Let's go back to our code window. So this is it、uh, for this tutorial. This tutorial we talk about how to use ODS to create an Excel、uh, file, and also this Excel file we created contains multiple Excel worksheets. All right. Thank you for watching. See you next time.